Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Battle Brothers. So we're here at Cobman Haven, and there's a couple contracts waiting for us, and also provisions that we need. Um, so let's grab some fish. Try and have three days of provisions would be nice. There we go. A lot of fish. Hope my guys like that fish. Uh, now, let's go track down some brigands real quick. The party is reasonably well equipped. Definitely need some better rangers. We're going to have to... Um, we're going to have to go back to that town with the Fletcher and see about getting some more hunting bows, which is uh, Suderberg. Okay, fantastic. Well, if we're going to Bullersby, which is up there, we're going to be passing by Suderberg anyways, so we can do that. Now, tracks southeast. Southeast is down here. So I'm assuming these tracks... Oh. Find a man sitting next to a hole in the ground. Beside him is a metal stake attached to, which is a chain that runs into the hole. The hole is covered with goat skins. He regards you with a wave, but says if you want to see it, you'll have to pay. You ask what it is. He's got He grins. The darndest thing, sir. A few more men stand off away, no doubt a part of whatever scheme is in play here. Um, we're not exactly short on gold, so sure. Uh, you flip the man a few coins. He puts in his teeth. You tell him to be wary of doing that. There's blood on some of them. He shrugs and pockets the pay. You come to the hole and the man throws the tarp off. A gruesome looking alp stares up and hisses at you with rows of sharp teeth and a face like curtain made of pale flesh. There's a shackle around its neck and the man whistles as the at the reveal as though it was the first time you ever saw it there. Uh, awful little bugger, ain't it? Don't get too close. It'll have you seeing things unless you want to do that, of course. Some folks do, but if you start seeing things and you enjoy them, you gotta pay a little more. Than, uh, you should probably kill that thing. Uh, such hideous creatures cannot stand to survive. You tell the man that it is likely to get its way out of the hole at some point and start wreaking havoc on the world, if not more so than usual in a fit of primeval vengeance. The man spits. Um, he's angry about, uh, I'm, I'm just gonna try and kill this thing and see what happens. Uh, we got 84 crowns. Cool. So we killed the Alp. Uh, his buddies all come in to fight us, which we win because we're cool. Uh, but everybody suffers light wounds. That's fine. Light wounds are not a major problem. I really hope we're going the right way here. Southeast is definitely this way. Alright, we are fighting some brigands. Brigand thugs, brigand poachers, and a brigand raider. No marksmen, which is good. Do not like fighting marksmen. Or goblins. Alright, what are we looking at here? Uh, okay, this force is not particularly well equipped. Um... We should focus on... It's this guy. He's the one who's in range. Thunk. D-trick, you can just chill. We might step out into these guys, depending on how ambitious they are about moving into us. Thunk. Ah, uh, their slingers are moving forward. Yeah, they're moving forward. Okay, so we are likely going to be stepping out to hit them. Just take the shot on the easy guy. And kill him. Nice. Not playing around there. Okay, so we are going to give up the high ground bonus for initiative here. Just step into these guys. Wow. Not, uh, not off to a great start there, dudes. Really not off to a great start there. Okay. Right around behind this dude. I'll uh, focus the raider. Nope, missed. Okay, I am actually just going to have Sigmar do this, and this, and this, and miss. Excellent. Okay, Rimald, you can go like so. Loop around this dude. There you go. Finally hit something. Oh. Okay, I'm just trying to put this guy down. Nope. Wow. Not off to a great start here, guys. There we go. All right. Two down in the first round is not bad, though. Okay, their slingers are coming up to support. I don't really care, though. Get this out. You can go help these guys. There we go. Stick flail man is not much of a threat to our guy who's wearing a helmet. Okay. Uh, you do not have quick hands, but that's fine, because you can actually just sit up here, linking arrows into these dudes. Okay, dagger dude steps forward. He is playing defense, which is fine by me, because I'm ignoring those guys. Raider playing defense is a little bit annoying. Well, Cleaver Man dies first, I guess, because he's in an unfortunate situation. Do you have quick hands? You do. Okay, good. Bill Hook. 
High ground. Swing. Nice. Ah, miss. Okay, well, this guy's dead. Oh, that broke everybody. All right. Wrap around him, boys. Nice. Yep. Just collapse in on these dudes. Go. Go. Okay, there. Yep, the slingers are leaving. I'm not going to bother chasing the slingers down. They have literally nothing of value. Just kill all their friends and call it a day. Really, all I'm getting out of this is wooden shields. There you go. I'm just going to pile into those guys. I guess we will kill that slinger after all. Um, Down here. Oh, okay. There we go. Now we're hitting things. Yeah, just surround these dudes. There we go. Yeah, why don't we just chase the slingers down? Why not? Since we're here. Wow. Okay, they're all dying now. Interestingly, the fight is still not over, which means the slinger is still interested in fighting us. I suspect he's just going to run off the map. And we're already going to let him, because he's... It's not worth it. There we go. Okay, no, it's over. I'm not going to bother chasing down that last dude. Uh, we suffered no injuries there at all. And Torsten leveled up, which is good. Uh, and we got some, like, junk that we can sell back at, uh, back at Cobman Haven. So, let's see what that level up before I forget. Torsten, you are pretty good at fighting. Oh, well. Oh. Uh, all right. I should maybe retire you because you're, you got, you got a lot of problems, dude. Um, geez, it's only level one or only level two. Um, yeah. Well. I could make you a spear and shield guy, but your melee defense is currently at minus 70%. He's got six melee defense with a shield. So, uh, I think I should just, uh, just fire you when we get back to town. Anyways, have, uh, some health and resolve and stuff, I guess, to tide you over while we walk back to town. Alright, we get our 420 crowns. Um, ooh, there's another contract available. First of all... Let's get rid of our... Alright, does anybody else need to be booted out from injuries? Torsten's out. We're going to pay him his compensation. So we don't hurt our morale. Uh, you're fine, you're fine, fine. No one else has actually suffered any permanent injuries. Oh, you're traumatized. Okay, that's fine, because you're in the back anyways. So you can be traumatized. Um, ah, Dietrich is greedy. That's fine. I'm willing to pay Dietrich's salary. He's, uh, he's very, very handy. Okay, so I would quite like a replacement frontliner if we can get one. Jeez, man. That guy starts at level 4, but he costs so much money. I think we're better off uh, grabbing one of the cheaper dudes. Pick up Ludolf here. Ludolf, what are you good at? Ludolf is mm, actually pretty well set up to be a spear and shield fighter if I have someone else I want to swap around here. What about you, Arn? Arn's not particularly good at melee. Hmm. I don't have anyone in the back line that I want to swap out, because they're all reasonably leveled up already. Okay, well, Ludolf, I guess you're just going to have to uh, be doing a thing that you're maybe not the best for. And... I mean, he's reasonable at fighting. Higher chance to hit head. Hmm, interesting. Uh, I'm going to give you a Morningstar. I'm going to stand right there. Fantastic. Now, anything else that needs doing? Not really. Everything seems in order. Uh, let's just make sure these shields and things are being repaired. Just so we have a bunch of spares lying around in case any get destroyed or damaged. Oh, and the helmets as well. Keep those Keep those uh, in good nick. Now, that should resolve that for now. I don't think... Mm, we could use someone in reserve. Now oh, we'll just hire Gernot. Why not? We got the money for it. Just have him hang out in reserve in case we need it. Wow! Oh, he's huge. Well, that's good. There's a lot of damage. 
I need more. I need two-handed fighters. Is what I need. I need to find somewhere where we can get good two-handed weapons to fill out our uh, fill out our damage dealers. So we are lacking in that. Okay, this guy wants me to deliver to Bullersby. Wow, everyone's going to Bullersby today. He is willing to pay us not as much money as the other guy. Interesting. Um, sure. I need some time to think about that, though. So, we probably want to take the this one, which is going to pay us all of the money to go to Bullersby. Um, so I'm going to accept that. There's not much else we need to buy in town here. And our morale is okay, so I don't think it's worth getting around to Valkal or anything. No, I think we're all good. Oh, I can sell some of this junk that we got from the raiders, though, right? Like, uh, yeah, a bunch of this stuff we don't exactly need to hold on to. Yeah, that should do. All right. Well, lead on caravan. Hang on. Do you guys sell bandages? You do. You know, I'm going to buy bandages and start giving them out to people. Probably a good thing to have. People in the, in the front line, I suppose. There we go. Okay, now the caravan can lead on. See if we can't, uh... We're gonna pass through a few towns that have armories. Suderberg has the Fletcher. Oh, Suderberg also has an armor and a weaponsmith, so we might be able to get some gear there. Although we don't have anybody who's particularly good at fighting. <laughs> it's kind of the problem. Our front line is very weak. Oh. That's not something I wanted to see. Well, here we are. See what we can do. I'm basically like I can't like flee from a contract because the res the renown penalty that we take will basically cripple us in our attempts to advance in any way. Uh oh wow, and I don't even have good shots on anybody. I think that's just because Sorrel's kinda bad at shooting. Well, let's wait and see if they come closer. They might just chill out back there and wait for us though. Well their crossbows are moving forward at least. I'm concerned about fighting like four or five brigand marksmen. Five, I think. Okay, are they coming forwards? No, they're playing defense. Well. Oh no, that guy's moving up. Oh, that guy's staying back to guard the marksman. That would do it. Well, we can try and hit the long axe guy, who I really don't like. Yeah, some of them are moving forward. Okay. They're actually splitting themselves up kind of nicely, which makes it convenient for us. Um, we can just try and wrap around this dude. Beat him up a little bit. Okay, now they're now they're jumping forward. All right. Hmm, okay. Well, Arn, you're going up here. That guy, quick jab for me. Uh, oh, jeez, that's a scary combo right there. I'm not a fan of that. Um. There we go. That's a good hit. Okay, let's get. Hmm, how best to do this. Alright, well, Hakone, you're going up here. Fight this guy. Yes, okay, that's fine. Manfred, let's get you over here. There go. And Sigmar, you are just gonna swap to your build hook and kinda wait in here. See what kind of damage we can do. There we go, good hit there. Alright, Romaldi, you're coming up here, and then. Shoot, I'm not gonna be able to shove him away and then move to take the high ground. Alright, hold for now. Next turn, you might be able to push that guy backwards and uh, take his spot. Carl, you're coming in here to help out. Miss, that's fine. Sorrel, you may as well just get your, your bill hook out as well. This fight ain't going anywhere anytime soon. You up here. Okay. Dietrich can come up here to back up these guys. Okay, that guy's still chilling out. Hopefully Longaxe guy also still chills out. Ah, no, he's moving in to join the fray. That's unfortunate. Okay. Yeah, here's where the marksmen start causing problems. I... He was aiming for someone. Okay. Now, I need to clear this guy up real fast so that I can try and get to Long Axe Man. Ah, shoot. He's shield walling. Okay, well, hopefully Manfred can land a hit here. Okay. We're going to crack that dude's shield open. 
That's my current plan. Mendel, you are going to get your bill hook out and or pike out and uh, oh, you don't have quick hands. Oh, unfortunate. Okay. Hmm. All right. Well, there's my chance to get to long axe man. Unfortunate. Bill hook forward swing miss. Um, 45. There we go. That's a good hit. So I can't shove this guy backwards anymore, which is a problem. Oof. God, her front line is just not not holding up here. Really not holding up here. Okay. 50. There we go. Alright, that's one down. Okay, this guy is shield walling, which is kind of a pain. Um... Hmm. Not much I can do about that, though. Right. Yeah, I've got not a lot of hit chance. I think we're better off just... Actually, we can attack once. And then still get some fatigue back at the end of the round. And this guy's already gone. Yep. Okay, this guy needs to be also gone. So let's try and wear him down. Ah, Manford. Okay. There we go. That's a good hit. And this guy's shield. Goes away. Thank you. Cameron hands are just chilling out of the back. That's fine. Marksman gets to go again. Okay. That's good. Ah, miss. Okay, this guy's the one I'm worried about. Oh, that's unpleasant. Okay, but they're actually kind of backing away, which is nice. Okay, that's fine. Um, Just keep swinging at him, I guess. Oh, yeah, there's the long axe doing what I was worried it was going to do. Lots of damage. These guys are piling in. I need, to, I need to figure out how to get that long axe. It's going to cause problems otherwise. Okay, well, Sigmar is uh, in unhappy condition right now. Okay, this guy is still shield long, so why don't we just wait and see if he continues doing that? Yep. He is playing super defense. Damn it. Okay, but I'm going to do this. We go. Now everybody's up on the high ground. Um. There we go. Okay, that guy's taking a beating. That guy's not in the best shape. He's playing defense. All right, Manfred. Come on, buddy. It's your time to shine. Oh, jeez, my front line is just, just too low level. It's a problem. Uh oh, Sigmar's running away. That's fair. Sigmar has taken like five arrows and a couple crossbow bolts already this fight. I think it's entirely reasonable for him to want to leave. Oof. Alright, need to move Dietrich up before he gets hit by anything. Okay. So far so good. That guy's gonna have to swap weapons. Alright, Dietrich, come up here. Give me a quick swing on. Thank you. Can't get any of their backline, though. This is a problem. Okay, you're going for the caravan hands, but I don't care about the caravan hands. So, you know, do your worst, guys. 37. There we go. Nope, that's a problem. I need to deal with that. I need to get this guy out of the way. Okay, he's not... Okay, he's not defending himself at all, which is good. Jeez. Oh, okay. There we go. Alright, so now we can get to their long axe man. Uh, this guy is shield rolling, which is unfortunate. So just take a swing at him and call a day. This guy. There we go. Okay, let's keep on driving forward here. Come on, Manfred, I believe in you. You may be kind of crap at hitting things, but... Wow. That's... that's no, there's no but to that statement, apparently. It's just... It's kind of crap at hitting things. Okay, everybody else is just doing stuff. Caravan hands, there we go. Ah, we go the marksman again. Okay, that's fine. Still can't hit this guy. He took he took a hit earlier. Oh, jeez, man. Marksmen are taking a toll. I don't have an effective way to reach them either. Okay. 
Uh, rude. Okay. Swordman misses attacks. Garrow can now shuffle up. That's a mistake, actually. That's going to put him in reach of the long axe. Garrow is just going to chill out where he is. Okay, that guy's playing defense. That guy's also playing defense. Oh, okay, Arn just straight died. And there goes my one chance to reach that long axe. Actually, Ulfric can reach the long axe. Hello, friend. Wow. Got everyone so fatigued, too. All right, let's just get this dude out of here. Come on, Manfred. There we go. All right, Manfred. Start closing on these guys. You know, Sigmar, you can just you can just chill out back here, man. I think you've I think you've done enough today. Okay, that guy's still chilling out back there. Marksmen are backing away, except that dude who's trying to kill Garrow. Sorrel. There we go. All right, you may as well wait because the line's gonna move up in a second here. Go. Alright, Garrow's gonna run away, but that's fine, because it's gonna put him out of range. Okay, Wendell. Up. Oh, get this dude a quick poke for me, thanks. Oof. Oh, right, that's Ulfert. Ulfert just took a bad hit. Okay, this guy steps in. Uh, I'm just gonna shove him off the cliff again in a second, so. Okay, Ulfert, you're in a rough spot. There you go. Just back that dude for me. Yeah, Sigmar, you're gonna chill back here. Okay, Nikone, up here. That's your turn, Manfred. God, I need to get you better melee skill. Oh, you're too fatigued to do anything. Shoot, okay. Hold your turn then. Oh, right, I was gonna move the line. That's what I was doing. Garo, uh, you know, you're just, you're just gonna leave too. Let's get out of here. Oh, camera hands are kind of moving forward to help me, which is nice. Oh, thank you. That's very kind. Please do it again. Nope, kill one of them. Okay, let's... Oh, he's so low. Oh, he gets to go before anybody else on our team. Or... That'll happen. Well, that's good. Wow. <laughs> the other raider immediately abandoned all of his, uh, all the archers shoot okay um well that was that we go okay he's trying well for it's in trouble Let's do something about that but I don't really have any options available okay, I was gonna stand behind the carts Sigmar's gonna chill out back here sax dude is chilling out okay this guy up some. There we go. Okay. Good. Okay, now he's broken. Oh man, Manfred's just so bad at hitting things. Please keep shooting your friends in the back. Dietrich actually doesn't have uh, switch places, which is unfortunate because I could use that to pull over safety. Nope, Wolfred's just dead. Oh well. We're doing okay. Okay. Wow, nobody can hit this guy though. Nope, nope. Just chill out back there. Or this guy, actually. There we go. There we go. Alright. Okay, Manfred is taking a beating. Let's uh, take a second here to catch our breath. Nope. Well, two of the marksmen are booking it. The two dangerous ones. Or, ah, the crossbow guy's still there. That's a problem. That thing will go through our armor. Okay. There we go. And then you can just back up a step here, because I don't want you getting caught. Um, What am I going to do with you guys? You're going to wait, because this guy's... Yep, yeah, coming up here. Ow. Okay. Garrow, you're chilling out back there. Wendell. Miss. Okay. 
This guy still needs to die and is causing me annoying amounts of trouble. This guy also needs to be gone. Thank you. I can't move over there, but he's in melee with the uh, caravan guard now. Oh, jeez. Alright, it's going to take us a little bit to catch up to these uh, marksmen. And for... Nope. Okay, it's still running. Still running. Sorrel, you can go here. Get ready to pick a fight with that dude. Go to her caravan hand. Ow! God damn it. There we go. Glad we have Dietrich around, at least. Okay, good. The other caravan hands are coming up to help us win this fight. Yes. I have to deal with that guy before he just straight up kills Manfred. Skip, skip. My, my lack of proper archers is really coming back to haunt me here. Um, you're already gone, right? Yeah, cool, so... Um, also, I don't have anyone to taunt. Oh, shoot, I shouldn't end my turn there. Okay, let's, uh... Just put that guy down, I suppose. Best we can do. Yeah, there goes. Well, Manfred's very dead. So much for nine lives. Oh my god, there's five guys left. It's literally all of their friggin' marksmen. And, like, this one dude here. This is kind of a pain. Oh, and those two marksmen came back. God damn it. Alright, well, we're just gonna have to chase these assholes around for a bit. Please stop firing crossbow bolts at me. I really, really don't appreciate it. And this guy's gonna run away before we catch him. Whoop. Yep, there he goes. Oh boy, oh, and this guy's still here. Okay, let's just, uh, screw some people up to help out. Just keep oh my god, Hakona's too fatigued to chase people! <laughs> ah! Will you brigands please just leave me alone? You're not gonna win this fight. You're just annoying me right now. Maybe if we kill their last, like, frontline dude, they'll give up. Or if Hakon just slowly walks after their marksman for five minutes. See, eventually they'll hit the edge of the map, right? Oh my god, that friggin' crossbowman's still up there. He's chilling out, and I absolutely cannot reach him, because I don't have any decent archers. A sad day. Alright, Dietrich, you're gonna chill back here. Please come help me, caravan hands. Oh my god, guys. There we go. Okay, please run away, other brigands. Please. You die. I don't like you. Okay, good. They seem to actually be leaving now. I'm gonna chase them off just to make sure. Okay, good. So it's just, there's two of them left. trick out of there just in case. Alright, let's surround this last brigand guy and just beat him, beat the crap out of him for a bit. Very slowly. So there's a dude around here somewhere. Ow. Okay, hopefully that crossman, yeah, he's gone. Alright, good. Now we just need to finish off this last dude up here. Messy fight. Guys, please. Please hit things. Come on, it's an unarmored brigand marksman sitting on a hill. Just just hit him. Please. He has no friends. He's, he's lost this fight. There we go. Romaldo at least has got my back. Cameron hands on the other hand. I guess they sort of helped out there. Come on, Wendell. Nope. Come on, Carl. There we go. Okay, four people dead for that, including Manfred, who we, like, just hired for, like, a thousand-something crowns. Um, at least we're getting gear out of this, so all is not lost. Hand out some of those kite shields to our front line. 
Even if they can't hit things, they can at least stay alive and keep the back line from getting mobbed. So that's the, uh, that's the idea. Wow, that's an empty front line we got right there. Okay, well, have a kite shield, the two of you who survived in the front line. Uh, Garnot, you... You are a spear and shield guy, so have a spear, have a shield, have a male shirt, and a hat. There you go, you're gonna go right there. Alright, and that, I think, is a good place to call it for today. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.